and we're back. Off the clock, I did a bit of a uh, leveling, as I said. Uh, I collected some new magic, and I had squalled that for about an hour, so that the other guys could gain a few levels. They're still completely unbalanced, but I got a bit tired of just standing around leveling. So yes, we're quite busy learning some new skills as well. Um, they are starting to have learned all, just about everything they have. Sorry about that. About that. Short interruption. Um, so yeah, the just started to learn just about everything, and I'm about ready to keep on going. Um, I was thinking of advancing the storyline, but first I've got just a short thing to do. So, I'll be back in a very short while, I need to check a few data, so, just a sec. Alright, back again, had to do something for my uh, parents. Alright, so, I'm completely back now, and let's see, uh, I was thinking of actually doing some seed rank increasing tests. We will begin the seed written test. Will you take a level 1 test? Yes. Draw command extracts magic from enemies. Yes, it does. Just stands for Garden Fighter. No, it doesn't. There are a total of 8 elemental attributes. Yes, actually. In battle, a higher strength stat causes more physical damage. Yes. HP Junction is a junction ability. Duh. Yes. You can't assign specific abilities for your GS to learn. No. Magic uses MP. No. You can name your GF. Yes. You can wear protective gear. No. GF level up with HP. No, that's what their abilities level up with. Oh, there we go. <coughs> so, we're gonna go on and do a few more. We take level 2 test. Yes. You can raise your fatality by junctioning magic. Yes. Squall's weapon is a gauntlet. No, that sells. You can stock draw magic. Yes. Any action taken while poisoned causes damage. There is no damage if you take no action. Yes. Being hit by a physical attack removes Confuse. Um, let me remember that one. Um, yeah, it does. Scrolls limit rated to Kenzo Kuken. No, Renzo Kuken. To junction magic, you need a matching junction ability for the stat you want to junction. Yes. Signifies junction ability. Error one. Yes, it does. The eight elements of fire, ice, thunder, poison, earth, sorcery, wind, and holy. No, that's not actually correct. And there is a limit to how much magic you can draw from monsters. No, there's no limit to how much you can draw from monsters. There's a limit to how much you can stop. All right. Well, that's so hard, actually. We take a level three test. Yes. Potions can restore GS HP. No, you need special potions for that. Magic can only be acquired by drawing from enemies. Actually, no, you can also get it from draw points. And from items and so forth. Sophie's weapon is an Nunchaku. Yes, it is. You only need money to remodel your weapon. No. Whoever strikes a finishing blow in battles receives the most XP. Well, um, yeah, that's actually correct. Jeff also has levels. The higher the levels, the stronger their attacks. Um, yeah. Uh, command ability, yes, I believe, uh, each party member can have up to five characters and party abilities, um, I'm not quite sure, no, I believe, command ability must be set to be used, yeah, that does, AP means action point, uh, ability point, I believe, oh, there we go, uh, they're getting harder. Level 4 test. Only Skull can use a gun blade. Uh, no, actually, there's also the uh, gun blade from Cypher. Attack magic can be used against party members. Yeah, actually it can. There's an ability that allows you to make magic from items. Yep. Higher fatality reduces physical damage. Is it? Uh, I think so. Blue magic is learned by being attacked by a monster. Nope. The magic dispel cures poison. Nope. If you are KO'd with status change, but are revived as battle, the status change is removed. Um, I believe it does remove it. But I'm not, um, let me see. Um, has it recently happened to me? Yeah, yeah, it does remove. 
The Rich Sergeant also lives in Bellum Gardens Training Center, among other locations, but that's not actually the only place, I believe. So, I reckon it's a no. I think. But at the same time, it is sort of. I'm just gonna go for yes, since it does live there, and this also has an advantage. Scrolls come late causes more damage by pressing the B7 at the right time. Now, that's basically just remembering which button it is. And I think. And uh, no, I believe it is. Yeah, no, it's the B6 button for me, I believe, or B5. You can start with 255 feet magic. No, it's 100. Ah, there we go. Ah, damn, they're really getting hard. Will you take level 5 test? Yeah, sure. Uh, signifies party ability. That would be a no, it's a single person ability. You can draw from party members. No, unfortunately. You can save the game anywhere. Um, on the world map? Yes. In other locations? No. When a GF learns an ability, some new abilities may appear. Uh, yeah, actually, that is possible. A character ability must be set, otherwise it is useless. Uh, <laughs> yeah. The higher the speed stat, the better your chances of using a limit break. No. I don't believe that. An ability is something you learn by gaining EXP. No. On a zombie, you succumb more easily to holy attacks. And that would be a yes. Physical attack means harm caused by use of weapons like swords and guns. Yep. You can steal... Uh, steel pipe from a Wendigo. Whoa. That's like... Damn. Um, I'm just gonna gamble with Yaz. Ah. Good. I had no idea about that one. Um, level 6 test. Sure. Sell weapons or gloves. Yep. You can still summon Jeff when silenced. Nope. If it can learn a fire magic refinery ability. I think I already learned that one, so yes. If more than one GF with the same junction ability is junctioned to a character, the effect of those abilities remain the same. Yep. All status changes return to normal after battle. Nope. You can use the attack and draw commands without junctioning a GF. Nope. You need draw for draw you need a GF, I believe. When you set scrolls scum blade on an auto, there is no need to press B6. Um that depends. Does that mean, like, um, in normal battle? Because I do believe you should press it there. Um, no, I suppose not. The magic status determines the strength and uh, effectiveness of magic. Yes. And when you're using auto... To junction, you can only choose from attack or defense. Uh, no, I believe you have a few other options. I got you to sleep attacks. Uh, those are those funny plants, and yes, they do. There we go. I already have rank 14. It's pretty neat to get some high ranks. I really suggest getting these, and all. Uh, it's handy, and you'll get some extra money. And uh, also, I've got an ability, by the way, by now. Um, which is yes. And that ability allows me to uh, get 10 Kiragas from a tent. So 1000 Gale means 10 Kiragas, which is pretty neat at this level. Evade indicates how well you can evade physical attacks. Higher evade stat reduces hits from physical attacks. That will be a big fat yes. Using fire against enemy that absorb fire raises their HP. Yep. Skull's finishing bow is different depending on the type of combat he uses. Yep. By using fire and magic refinery, you can refine five fires from one M stone piece. Um, yep. Only one rare card exists in the whole world. Uh, really, where did I get that one? I believe one rare card exists in the whole world. Sounds a bit... Well... I'm not sure. I believe, yeah, you can have only one rare card of a rare card, I reckon. But at the same time, you can have multiple rare cards, so. It all depends on how you look at it. I suppose it's a bit of a trick question, so yes. A sometimes uses fire. 
that would be... Um, I'm not really making this hard now. 